Cao Cao, Sun Quan, Liu Bei. Following the Battle of Chirbi, these three men became the center of everything. Cao Ren, charged with the defense of Jiangling, performed admirably against the combined onslaught of Sun Quan and Liu Bei. Even though the city eventually fell to Zhou Yu, he was able to hold out for more than a year. Afterward, Cao Cao again began plotting a campaign to invade the South and sent for Ma Tung. Ma Tung was one of the men involved in the previous attempt to assassinate Cao Cao. Cao Cao was determined to eliminate this possible threat before making his move south. However, his actions would lead to trouble in the west. With his father killed, Ma Tung's son, Ma Chao, gathered an army together with Han Sui and rose up against Cao Cao. Cao Cao was forced to postpone his southern campaign and instead sent his troops to Guangzhou. He was more than prepared to face his new adversary, a man consumed by the desire for revenge. The strategies of his master tactician at the ready, they came head to head at Tong Gate. I suppose it is from fatigue, but Lord Cao Cao seems to have lost his edge. Really? Well, isn't it the job of a strategist to cover for that? Hmm. It is hard for even me when he does too much. You seem tired, my lord. Joshu, tell me, what strategy have you devised for us? We will strike them head on. The enemy is filled with people from Guangzhou. You mean to destroy them from within? Precisely. I have heard that you and the... So, you are in need of my assistance for your plan. Excellent, Lord Cao Cao. Now, if... It's too cold here. The time is nearly upon us. Underst I am putting you in charge of my forces for this battle. Don't let me down, Joshu. You wish me to command your army? Very well. Our first step must be to blunt the momentum of their mounted troops. We must claim strategic points on the front line. Fight me now! For glory! But the old South Sound would never have given his strategies to their control. I 
must retreat. This is not the end. There is not a strategist alive that can best move in battle. <laughs> Dai is charging forth from the enemy ranks toward us. He wishes to eliminate Lord Saitsa directly. He must be stopped at once.
not a strategist alive like the best move in battle. Oh, that's great! I'm gonna try that too! Watch me! This is not the end! that I would survive this battle. So I guess this is goodbye. There is not a strategist alive that can best move in battle. Meddling strategist! Face me if you dare! Stop me if you can! My men fight for. 
for as long as I do, and I will never give up. Wan Jong now belongs to you. Where will you go from here, my lord? Future is unknown. Really? I thought you were a man of vision. I am. I simply realize that things do not always go as planned. Including the fates of Liu Bei. Sun Quan, and indeed, my own. I think you're right. Our Lord does seem a little tired. Time is limited. Ma Chao fell in defeat before the strategies of Cao Cao and Jia Xu. Fearful of Cao Cao expanding his influence in the West, Liu Zhang of Yi turned to Liu Bei for help. Considering the chaos of the times, this proved to be a costly mistake. Sensing an opportunity, Liu Bei left Guan Yu in charge of Jing and moved to invade Yi. By seizing Yi from Liu Zhang, Liu Bei managed to establish a foothold in his own quest for power. Cao Cao of Wei, Sun Quan of Wu, and now Liu Bei of Shu. The land was divided into three. Upon hearing of Liu Bei's conquest of Yi, Cao Cao advanced his men toward Han Zhang, which was under the control of Zhang Lu. By securing Han Zhang, which lay to the north of Shu, he would seal off Liu Bei's movements. Indeed, it seemed a very natural move for the ruthlessly logical Cao Cao to make. However, Sha Ho Yuan and the others felt uneasy as they headed for Yangping Gate. They felt as if Cao Cao was uncharacteristically acting out of haste. Time is limited. Even the hero of chaos could not change this law of nature. General. It is time Lost in thought, General? I was thinking about how it used to be just me doing and our Lord. Our kingdom has grown. And that's a good thing, you know. But... The people have been drawn to the three of you. It's only natural. And this battle? is your chance to prove why. Well, we can't be late. Let's get going. We'll dazzle them! 